And one of the shocking incidents happened at the Gomti Nagar extension in Lucknow, where the son of additional SP was shot dead by this XUV 700, which is right now at the police station of Gomti Nagar extension, which has been recovered, trashed by the UP police. Now, what has been said that on the Tuesday morning, Namish, the son of additional SP Shweta Shivastava, was there, he was doing the exercise cycling, but at the same time, this car, which was un in uncontrollable speed, hit directly Namish there, and afterwards, uh, you know, what happened is that Namish got badly injured and during his treatment in the hospital, he lost his life. Now, this car which you can see on your screen right now is completely damaged from the front side of it on the left hand side and two of these accused who were uh, uh, riding this car, one of them said to be Dev Shivarma, who is uh, a student of engineering, is a son of uh, two very prominent dwellers of Kanpur and Lucknow. And the other one, Sarthak Singh, is said to be the son of Naveen Singh, who is, uh, has been the member of Jila Panchayat from Namnagar, from the Samajwadi Party. Now, the police has traced, these, traced this car at further speed and also at the same time both of these boys have been uh, taken into the custody the interrogation is underway and at the same time both the families haven't spoken anything shweta shivastava is, is extreme in his extreme shock and at the same time this incident has raised a lot of questions about the security and at the same time how this whole case has taken a big question as far as you know uh, the traffic system and other things are concerned but it looks like that with all these questions needs to be answered, the investigation is underway and the Gomti Nagar Extension Police is doing the investigation. And so far, both of these boys have uh, been arrested. They, into the, they are into the custody and a son of additional SP has lost his life because of this rash drive. In Lucknow with cameraman Rohit Abhishek Mishra for India Today.